Hey, welcome back to a vlog. Catfish on the TV. If you watched last week's vlog, it's literally right. I'm in the same place I was when I ended that vlog off. And we're starting a new week, okay? And it is a Sunday. Not, not listening, so we're gonna watch TV, not our iPad. We've been having a little bit of toddler drama these last couple days. But yeah, Mello is over there chilling on the couch. This whole setup is just a lot. But anyways, y'all hear the boys yelling in the background. Welcome to Mom Life of Three. Anyways, but it's Sunday. I need an actual reset day, okay? Like a real self-care Sunday, but like reset like realistic my house is a disaster okay there's bottles or there was bottles over there i do not get in the middle of their arguments anymore so anyways yeah let me show you guys the house is a mess and this is just the first floor so <clears throat> I'm gonna start cleaning. I feel like I've been getting really anxious about how I do everything because you guys know when I clean, I also make it content sometimes when I have like my self care motivation things. And I've been wanting to make everything content, right? I've been wanting to make content out of everything. And you know, y'all know I'm very aesthetic -y when I be doing those type of videos, but today we can't do one of those very, very aesthetic videos. Y'all are just gonna hang out with me and literally clean as part of this vlog to just really get back get my shit together so I can stop overthinking. So I'm gonna pick everything up that's in here that doesn't belong in here and put it in the next room. The next room I'm working out is gonna be the kitchen. And then I just keep going until all the rooms are clean. And then I usually come back and do the floors. So we have like some trash in here on the couch. I need the vacuum on the couch, all that good stuff. So yeah, we're just gonna go ahead. We're gonna start. I'm just curious how long this would actually take me if I just stop bullshitting and like get it done and stop overthinking it like I normally do. So it is 11.29 right now and let's go. All right, we've got water, earrings, popcorn all over the couch. Oh, It took me seven minutes to clean the living room. I'm trying to get clean today, huh? Okay, moving on to the kitchen. It's 11.37, so we're gonna see how long it takes me to clean all of these.
Okay, it is much, much, much later. And the last place I really need to finish is like the dining room. I ended up taking a nap from like 4 to 6.30. Um, two people are still napping over there. <laughs> um, but we got Domino's for dinner because obviously if I was asleep till 6.30, I didn't cook. So, yeah, we get um, chicken alfredo. We all really, really like the chicken alfredo pasta from Domino's. So I got like three of those and it's so good. And then I also got a brookie because I was going to make brownies earlier and then I fell asleep. So I got cookie brownies. Um, but I finished the kitchen for the most part. I just need to put all the bottles away. They've been drying while I was sleeping. So I just need to put all the pieces back together and stuff. So got our brownie cookie. And then I also got a chicken jalapeno pizza on thin crust. That's my favorite. And then I got the kids like a ham and pepperoni on thin crust as well. I made the kids a little like snack charcuterie plate today and it had like Crackers, strawberries, turkey. Oh, there's a freaking gnat in here. Please land so I can kill you, you stupid. Anyways, that's what happens when you don't do the dishes. Um, yeah, the only thing they didn't eat on it was cheese, but they were like eating at it all day. Like Ritz crackers, turkey, cheese, strawberries, and something else. Popcorn. Popcorn. eat real quickly we zoom back cleaning Care of for sponsoring today's video. Care of believes that you deserve to feel your best this summer from taking a mental break, enjoying your favorite seasonal dishes, to getting outside and traveling. Care of is here to help you take care of yourself all summer long. Care of's convenient individual packs make traveling super easy. Just grab one for each day that you're going to be gone and your vitamin routine is set even when you're away from home. And all you have to do to get started is take a short in-depth quiz about your lifestyle and health goals to get personalized recommendations, taking the guesswork out of what supplements are best suited for you. 
I love my Care Up packs because they have everything I need to support my postpartum health, including my prenatals, cranberry, ceramides, keratin, calcium plus, ashwagandha, and turmeric, which all help to support either my hormones, my feminine health, or even my milk supply. For 50% off your first Care Up order, go to takecareof.com and enter code McKennaWalker50. And thank you again to Care Up for sponsoring today's video. Make sure you click the link in my description box for 50% off your first order. this morning, which I'll take Mama, it. Mama, put it like that so we can have more. Okay, I was pumping like probably like 12 ounces in the first couple weeks when I was coming home in the morning because it was like my biggest, like the morning session is usually when you get the most. So yeah, we're starting out with five. We'll take it. I'll see y'all later. What's that? <laughs> oh, it says I ain't got no I'm on here. I must have put the wrong memory card back in my camera. Hold on, y'all. Dang. Okay. Back in business. We're at Target, but I forgot to say that I was on the way. I do not know how to turn the air down in this car. It's still saying I have zero minutes left on the camera. Okay, I figured it out. I figured it out. I think this is us. I do not know how to pop the trunk in this car either. Ooh, or roll down, roll down. Hi. Do you I just wanted to ask, like, if you wouldn't mind saying that you're on the way before you actually arrive. Yeah, sure. It was the trunk is still good, though. Uh, back seat. Thank, Thank you. you. say that or if she just like um fed up with people not saying they're on their way when we drive up i usually always say i'm on my way but dang girl i forgot one time i never seen her before though so attitude it's the ew is that a fucking gnat did i just touch a fucking gnat oh my god that looks rough. i was trying to see what this thing does oh my god bitch stop clicking so oh Oh my god, y'all look. This is the mouse pad. The and then this is the screen. Right here. And then you use this to like move it around. Oh, that's why. Okay. <laughs> it's a computer in this bitch. Okay. Yeah. Anyways. Oh. Mm -mm. Yeah, this is Aaron's new car for the time being. I don't, I don't I don't know if he's keeping it or what. Um, but yeah, it's a. It's my lens dirty too. Hold on, guys. It's a Mercedes um, something E class. I don't know exactly. I do not know how to drive this. Yikes. Okay, well, we got our target drive up and we're going back home. That's it. I was going to try to go somewhere else, but I do not like driving cars that I don't drive often. Like, it's not giving. It's not giving. It's not giving. Oh, but you know what is giving? Going to Starbucks. So we're about to go to Starbucks because why not? It's right here. Starting in July, though, we're going to save money and we're not going to be going to Starbucks every single day because... I don't know what y'all been hearing about the little recession thing that's supposed to be happening. 
but I'm not fucking with that. And I've been getting really scared. I don't know if it's because like my whole TikTok feed is just like all it's talking about is literally like recession, recession, recessions, um, or what. But it's kind of making me a little bit nervous because we about to move and all that too. So I'm like, mm, it's time to start saving up the coins. Where's the park? Okay, the park is a button like my car. Turn it off. Get the key out. Anybody else feel slow when they be driving cars? Especially new, new cars. Like if y'all, like if you have been driving in a car that ain't that new, like myself, um, for the past, well, like, I guess that's not even true. Like, I guess, like, I had, like, a newer Honda, but, like, when you get into, like, these new fancy cars, they are, like, um, the little gadgets and gadgets and buttons. Like, this is how you move the seat up and down. Like, the whole time, I was trying to, like, move my seat down here, you know, on the side, because that's where it normally is. No, it's right here. You, like, push this back and forth and up and down, up and down, and I was like, oh. okay, anyways. Let's go on Starbucks. It's not busy, but there's literally a ton of people behind the register. Okay. Should I take you guys in with me? I'm scared. Let's go. Thank you. You too. Ooh. Okay, I got a pink drink. I didn't get it with sweet cream cold foam. I'm trying not to get it with sweet cream cold foam anymore just because I've been like having that way too much and it's not like the best for you to be drinking it all the time. It's definitely giving cavity, but I was trying to find somewhere to put y'all, but I can't. So I'm gonna see y'all when I get back to the house and I'll show y'all what I got for my drive up order. It wasn't a lot, it was just like some small things for the house. Um, and I'm going to talk to y'all. I keep trying to move the seat up over here, but it's over here. Hopefully this doesn't fall down. We're back. See if we do it. It's the two big sweatpants for me. Only things I got was oat milk. Clementines. Get off there. You dirty. Get your get off the floor. Two bags. You want an orange? I was surely gonna make y'all a snack charcuterie board. I will. Just wait a minute. Just wait a minute. Some Tide Lounger pods. I'm about to make you some snack. Go sit down. And then some Cascade Free and Clear. I really got these. I thought they would be like aesthetic. I have like those clear bins under the sink that you use to put them in. They smell good. <laughs> Two six packs of water. And then like eight packs of these creative root coconut waters. Because I literally bought eight packs on Friday before the weekend. And they're all gone. So me and the kids like this. Ew. Got a lot of ills on my mind And my friends Yeah, I keep my friends on my mind I'm in love I'm in love with two girls at one time And they tens That's why I got ten on my mind I got ills Got a lot of ills on my mind And my friends Yeah, I keep my friends on my mind Should repent I need me some Jesus in my life Ain't me Four, four, but I love me a dish Be on my daily, this shit my little secret Trying to ditch me to go up, I peep it I can't respond with just do it people If I love some rats on the bed, you can keep it This shit getting deeper and deeper, I dig it My shit don't want me and I would go ahead and fix it My shark in the water, you swim with it I'm gonna get the day by tomorrow, she gonna see I got the best shit, I got the best shit, I got the best shit I got the best shit, I Good morning, y'all. I look crazy. What's new? This battery is about to die too. <sighs> All right, I found a charge of battery. Boom, boom, boom. The camera is shaking a little bit. Okay. All right. It is Tuesday morning. It's nine twelve, and. 
let's get into it. So basically, everything that I had planned this week for the most part, I rescheduled because I got a lot of stuff to do and work to do and I backed up the vlog last week and I, I, I got to get back on a schedule and a regiment and I also have been going back and forth about, let me get to driving because I need to get right back to the house, but um, my gas light better not be on. Okay. Let me tell Target I'm on my way to. We're headed to Target to pick up a drive up order. Um, Target, Target, Target. Let me say that I'm on my way because y'all know homegirl yesterday was the weekend. She was tripping, okay? But let's, let's go to Target real quick. This is why I do not be wearing my hair curly because what is going on? What is going on? Whew. Baby Mello asleep. It's 2 o'clock. I just finished. So Paige just went home. She was helping me this morning with the baby. Very chaotic. Every day the house is a mess. I'm not even gonna keep on apologizing about my house being a mess because just know that every morning when I wake up, my house is usually clean because I've been doing better. But then by the time the day gets started, it's a fucking shit show. So I need to stop cursing. I'm gonna have to put a trigger warning in my vlog description in the next video because I am like been cursing a lot lately, which is a bad habit of mine. I don't like to, I was trying to, I'm trying to stop cursing so much. It is like a really bad habit that I've had ever since I was young though. Like I've just always been a cursor. So <laughs> anyways, I got this laptop case. I wanna see if it fits on my laptop. I got it off Amazon. I know the girlies be getting this from Etsy's, but I don't be having time for Etsy shipping. Like I want it and I want it now. Came with like a little keyboard thing too. I've been pumping all day also you guys and been getting no milk so I'm just I don't know what I'm gonna do at this point like, I ate a lot I've had a lot of protein today a lot of snacks a lot of water I've had um like I'm almost halfway done like halfway I'm halfway to 100 100 fluid ounces and that's how much you should be drinking when you're breastfeeding and I ain't got no milk. And my tits hurt. <sighs> okay. This is my new MacBook. I don't even think I showed it to you guys in the last vlog. But when I was editing, I was surely talking about it. But I got a new, I got the newest one. Um, it's a MacBook Pro. It's a 14 something inches or like the smaller Pro. Because I didn't want the big one. Because I think that's ridiculous to try to carry it around. Um, but I finished editing my vlog. Only thing I have to do now is add pictures. I mean, not pictures, music. And make a thumbnail and upload it to YouTube. And then it'll be good to go. This is what the case looks like. I think it's cute. It's cute or whatever. It's like the alligator type skin. Yes. Should we put this on here? I don't even know if it's going to stay. Do you just like lay it over? Or what? Oh yeah, that's kind of cool. I just laid it on there. I think it's kind of sticky. Cute, cute. This vlog is two hours and three minutes long. We love a good vlog. We love the girls love the long vlogs. Okay. So yeah, only thing I have to do is add music to it. I might try to do that while he's low key asleep. Um, just so I can get it done. I'm definitely going to finish it today, even if I like stay up a little bit later tonight and finish it just because that way I don't even have to worry about it tomorrow. And then I'm kind of like sad because I thought I was going to have to do like this other thing tomorrow for like, um, oh my God, fuck, I forgot to go to the UPS store. We got to do that right now. Bump everything else I was talking about. We got to go to the UPS store right now. Mel has to wake up. Okay, I'm going to finish this later. I had rescheduled my lash appointment and everything because I thought I was going to have to film this other video for this sponsored content. And then they were like, no, we'll just do it another month. I was like, oh, the audacity. I already like rescheduled my appointment. Probably going to text her and see if it's still available so I can go tomorrow. Because I need to keep up with my films. I'm about to do that right now. I'm about to text her and be like, I know I rescheduled my appointment, but is it still available? And then we have to go run by the uh, UPS somewhere to get a box i had to pee too it's too much going on 
I'm trying to see if I put sunglasses on my head. Does it make me look less of a hot mess? I don't know why I think adding sunglasses to my head makes everything better. All right. Whatever. If you see me out in public, no, you didn't. I am going to put sunscreen on before I go, though, because I forgot to put my sunscreen on. And I'm not going to be getting any more wrinkles than I already got. Because I need to get Botox. <laughs> I can't do the stuff here. Nah, dog. Well, it has, like, precedent over Like, that's... You rather... No! <laughs> Okay, I'm at my lash appointment. It's the next day. I haven't seen y'all since yesterday. Hair is looking <laughs> like we should have went to that appointment yesterday. Okay, anyways, y'all have if y'all have not seen them TikToks, I'm sure y'all have. No, 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 but those no. videos were like, he's a ten, but his hairline was receding. Or so. This is my like favorite one. It cracking me up. I'm gonna try to link it in the description box. Yo, it's funny. Okay. I'm on my last appointment though, so I'm gonna go in. I, I don't know why I really just came on here to tell y'all hi, cause I'm about to run in really fast to grab, grab a fill, get a fill. Um, yeah, we got a lot to do these next couple of days, so I don't know how much I'm gonna see y'all today, uh, but I'm gonna show see y'all tomorrow and the rest of the weekend. <sighs> sun is in the back okay hold on that's not gonna work it's not gonna work for me it's gonna be like that the whole time i'm driving wow tomato 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 okay anyways good morning it's been a couple days since i saw you guys because uh, we've been having a lot going on okay carson came home was it yesterday the day before yesterday he was kind of sick just not feeling good so he's been at home with me under the weather um it's friday by the way and i got carter with me we just drove by my mom's to pick something up really fast and we're headed back to the house and it's like 8 30 because the boys are going with their grandma and their uncle to tyler for the day to see their great grandma because it was her birthday yesterday so it's like a hour and a half drive from here and they're gonna go for the day and then come back like this afternoon or evening or whatever um so it's just gonna be me and Mello today um i have a nail appointment that i'm about to go to at like 9 30 and then i'm supposed to pick up the keys for the house today if you guys know i ended off the last vlog saying that we was gonna pick up the keys to the new house because we ended up getting the house i was supposed to get them yesterday <laughs> So, I guess I'm just doing like a quick little, a quick little run through because we're finna leave. There's no power on right now and it's hot as SHIT. So we're gonna do a quick little um, house tour real fast. And then I'll see y'all back when we get back to our other house because it's just too hot here to stay, so. Okay, so when you first come in, this is what you see, there's these little cubbies, perfect. Carter, Carson, and Carmelo. The boys can put their stuff right here when they come home from school. And then right off of here, we have the half bath. There's no power. I don't know why I turned the light on, but yeah, this is what we're looking like. The sink, toilet, some, oh, this is a whole cabinet, I guess, under here. Oop. And then we have the kitchen. So obviously stove cabinets microwave refrigerator there's a little little a little wine fridge which i'm so happy they had and then we have the pantry so excited to organize this i can tell me so fucking cute and then the island baby mellow is asleep and then this is the living room area so there's cabinets fireplace mantle another set of cabinets and then it's just like up 
big open open space so i don't know where i'm going to put the dining room table i don't know if it'll look right right there but we can't just have just the couch again and i don't want to put it right here because you could put like a couch like a section in it you may even have like either two love seats or like two chairs and make it to... but where are we gonna eat at well anyways okay this is the backyard patio i'm not gonna go all the way out there right now did we walk it back okay yeah patio there's a patio there's like a place to hook up the tv and then there's a yard there which i'm so excited for the kids and then this is gonna be most likely the kids playroom because this is the only like bedroom down here on this floor so i'm thinking the kids will just put their all their toys in here and then it has a little closet okay okay so right at the top of the stairs is the first bedroom so this is probably going to be carter and carson's bedroom because it's huge um, they're still going to share a room because they like sleeping together anyways. So this will be both the boys' bedrooms. Or, yeah, and then Carter and Carson. This will be their closet. So I'll probably just get some small dressers. And then their stuff will be perfectly separated. And then they have a Jack and Jill bathroom. So this is their bathroom. They both have their own sinks. I'm going to get them some little step stools. It'll be so cute. And they can just get themselves ready in the morning. They really like doing stuff like that. So that's exciting drawers obviously cabinets and then their bathroom areas right here so they have shower tub toilet and then this will be Carmelo's room or the nursery once we get there he'll probably be sleeping with us for a while but this would be like his space unless Carter and Carson decide they want their own room and then this is also the other closet here. Phew, I don't know how I feel about carpet, but ain't gonna be no food upstairs. This is like a little hot water heater closet storage space. The camera's bright, okay. This is the well laundry room. I can't turn on the light because the power's not on, but y'all will see it will be living here, so it's cute. There's lots of storage. It's gonna be real aesthetic -y. I'm so excited. And this is the master. So this is what it looks like. It's very, very spacious. Super, super long. They're gonna, we're gonna put shades up and then get curtains and stuff, but. And this is the first closet right here off the bedroom. It has a little bit of shelving, regular closet. And then my favorite part besides the kitchen is the bathroom so we have double vanity obviously super cute y'all know this is like my aesthetic the black and the white well if you don't know now you know that's my jam right there then we have some storage here for towels there's like so much storage i love it um and then look this is the shower super 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 cute and then we have the bathtub She's gonna be my favorite place to be, so super cute. Love the little frosted window. Love this tile in here. And then we have the toilet closet right there. And then look. Wow. A big ass closet. When I first seen the house, I was like, oh my god, it's huge. So it'll be really cute. We can organize the clothes real aesthetic. It's just gonna be so cute. So. <laughs> That's it. We're here. We won't be here. You probably got, well, you guys will probably see me going back and forth in between the houses, um, like in vlogs and stuff, but our lease is not up at our other place till the end of the month. So we'll just be moving like slowly. Of course, we're going to have moving vlogs and we're going to do organizing and get everything ready. I'm hoping to like really do that. Like since we have this long period of time to move like almost a month to just like take my time, organize as I'm going. So that way, by the time we actually are living here, everything is just organized. I don't have to worry about boxes and setting everything up. Like we can just it'll just be ready and then the kids can just come in and it'll just flow really easily so that's the plan but it's literally been the longest day trying to get this whole process done 
has taken literally the entire day. I was supposed to go to the nail shop with y'all this morning and a whole bunch of stuff. I had to reschedule that. It's 4th of July weekend, so we got a ton of plans this weekend. So even though I didn't vlog a lot during the week, we're gonna be hanging out all weekend doing just like family stuff for 4th of July and we got birthday parties to go to. So yeah, it's hot as shit though. So we're finna go. So I'll see you guys when we get back to the house. Hey. Hold on, y'all. Look at bra. Bra is on. Okay. We back in there. Anyways, I'm getting ready. Me and Mello just took a little relaxing bath together. Um, and I'm just, I don't even know what to do with my hair because it's literally like five inches long. And I'm going to get my hair done on Monday. So I'm not gonna straighten it because I don't wanna just keep putting heat on it like that. Like I'm already gonna get it pressed on 4th of July. Actually, I don't even know if I'm gonna get it pressed. I was gonna ask her to like blow it out and give me like two little cute French braids or something. Just something like cute for the summer or whatever. Some of y'all don't like my color of my hair. <laughs> but it's okay. Like I don't know, maybe you skipped a part of the vlog where I was like, this is not the end result of the color. Even though I like it, it doesn't look the same like in all different lightings but it's not bad and it's growing on me. I know it's like a shock and an adjustment when you first see it, but this was not the end color that I was going for. I definitely want to be like mm, plat platinum blonde or I'm going to add more brown back into it, but just thug it out with me, okay? Like y'all don't got to be hating on the color. It's cool. My hair was permanent black before this, so it's, it was going to give like yellowish undertones and stuff like that beforehand, but everybody else looks like I love I really been titled to their own opinion. I didn't like it at first when I first got it done either. Like, not that I thought the girl did a bad job, like I just didn't like it on myself. So it just took me a while to get used to it. And now that I'm used to it, I like it. I think it's fun. I've never had my hair like before. So we gonna thug it out. <clears throat> um, but let me catch y'all up while I'm getting ready. So I went to my six week postpartum checkup. Um, it was technically seven, oh, shit. Kind of. it was technically seven weeks, but, um, but anyways, yeah, I went to my postpartum checkup, you guys, y'all know what I'm talking about, getting my tubes tied, and um, so I'm like on the pill until I get my tubes tied, which they said they could schedule it for me in like two to three weeks, but my OB was also telling me like, your man should just get his, his tubes tied, like basically get a vasectomy, so me and Aaron have been talking about that too, so he might get a vasectomy instead of me getting my tubes tied, because like, it's just easier and for him to do it than it is for me to do it. They were basically telling me like the, how the procedure would go um, is like, and the reason why I settled before I get into it on getting my tube side is because one, I have three kids um, already. <laughs> and then two, because I also know like if I get my tube side, that doesn't mean I could never have a baby again. I would just have to go through IVF, um, which is doable. You know what I mean? Like I'll just put the money to the side to save it. If I ever, for whatever reason, decided to have another baby, I could definitely still do that. Um, it's just, I wouldn't be able to conceive naturally which is fine because if I ever want to have another baby hopefully it'll be very intentional um but yeah I don't think that I, I don't I don't have any desire to have anymore so but just a disclaimer because I know people were like you know don't get tie your tubes or whatever but anyways I might not Aaron might get a vasectomy so we talked about that so we're gonna be either going one of those two routes in the next couple weeks but since I got back on hormonal birth control I literally took it for one day y'all and look it freaking gave me a <laughs> But they give you birth control that doesn't have estrogen in it, I think, whenever you are breastfeeding. So it's not supposed to really mess with my milk supply, but I did notice. Are you talking to me? Hi. I'm talking to my friends. Yeah, I didn't say hi. I don't know why I said I was really going to get ready, because y'all know my get ready to me don't do nothing but some eyebrows slicking up. And then I'm going to put some highlighter on. I'm using this one by Moret. I actually got this in PR a long time ago and it's really similar to like my Fenty highlighter and so I've been using this lately to just do my little highlight on my cheeks and stuff. I want to say it's like an outside restaurant so I'm wearing um, just jeans and a tank top like really casual something. I'm wearing the same jeans that I wore at my birthday dinner but y'all didn't even get to see the whole well I think y'all saw like me try on the jeans but like y'all didn't even see my whole outfit because I barely even vlogged. Cause when we went to Nick and Sam's for my birthday, y'all like the food was so good, but like the customer service was ass. Like I'm about to write them like a horrible Google review because they were so rude to me and Aaron and just like 
like it was just me Aaron his his best friend um my friend or his his friend's girlfriend and they were just like so rude to us like they sat so many people in front of us even though we had reservations and like there was tables open like we sat ourselves like Aaron like literally walked into the dining room at Nick and Sam's and like saw a table that was empty and he was like we're sitting here and he got a waiter and brought a waiter over and that's how we got sat after an hour of being there so it like yeah and then like I had went to the bar and Aaron was talking to one of the girls and he was like she was so rude to me and I was like bring myself back together because I get like I can get like super like girl what if I talk to you? okay so um, I'm trying to decide what perfume I want to wear because I think it's we're going to this place called um I don't know I'll show y'all when we get there I'm gonna try to vlog a lot when I'm like while I'm there and stuff because I know I haven't like been seeing y'all but it's really because I haven't been doing nothing like I got done with all my work like like editing and stuff like earlier in the week than I thought I was and then like on Wednesday I kind of just like chilled out Carson had came home early from school because he wasn't really feeling good and I just have been chilling with the boys and then yesterday I was supposed to pick up the keys so I was going to come talk to y'all when I picked up the keys but then it became like this whole thing and I didn't so I was like ain't no point in me even picking up the camera so the last couple days I really ain't been on shit um so I'm lucky gonna have to like film a little bit this weekend i'm gonna wear my gypsy water i don't really normally wear this when i'm going somewhere outside but it's just like a clean scent and it's like my go-to i i really 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 like this if y'all go to uh neiman marcus they have like a whole counter whatever the brand is i can't say it for sure it's b-y-r-e-d-o yeah so this time we're going with the hair i don't know i was thinking about moving my bun like back a little bit i don't know how i feel that just right I usually do a claw clip, but I didn't know if my hair could do a claw clip since it's so short. I haven't tried with my curly hair yet. So I think I might push my bun like a little bit back like that. Like just maybe bobby pin it back. So it's not like right on the top of my head. What's wrong with little LL? I can't tell if you like his pacifier or not. He has one of those bubba nubs. Carter and Carson loved woven ups, like they woven up was their best friend. But Mello, I don't know. Does it look worse or better, y'all? I think that looks worse. I can't really tell. I'm not going for anything like super cute. I really need to learn how to do my hair on oh, God. I gotta stop walking around with my my hair. To Are you such a good baby? Are you such a good baby? You ready to eat, eat? Okay, well that was my little get ready. I'm gonna brush out my eyebrows, but I'm not gonna do anything else. I don't even have a lip sharpen or a pencil sharpener to sharpen my. You get upset? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're just as cute as can be. But yeah, I'm about to feed him, change him, get him ready to go over to my mom's. He's gonna go to my mom's for like we're literally gonna be at dinner for like two hours and then when the kids come back home from Tyler we'll be back because it's like seven o'clock right now so I'm not gonna be gone long and then tomorrow we got a birthday party to go to so I'll take y'all with us and all that good stuff but yeah going to Haywire yo <laughs> we're at well we were supposed to be going to Federales is that how you say it Federales yeah, Federales <laughs> <laughs> but apparently there's been a change of plans and we're going somewhere else so we'll have to come back and go to federales yeah, a different because time because they got this thing where you can like take a shot and then throw it at the bell it's like trending on tiktok or whatever but we're supposed to be going there for dinner i literally look at my song <laughs> okay it's 10 minutes away okay i hope they have ballet because this downtown shit is not not the move not the move so I guess I'll see y'all when we ever get to the to the, the other place. To fucking eat. We ain't ate all day. Oh god. <laughs> I wasn't even recording. I got a frozen long eyewear. I didn't even get that. To her? I said, what do you recommend? And she was like, I said, I usually get a long eyewear. She said, we have a frozen version. I said, fine. <laughs> Like Tito's with like sweet and sour with like some wine. 
Yeah, this is gonna get you right. I'm probably just gonna get that. You wanna try it? I know what you taste like. You've had them frozen yeah. before? Yeah. Frozen? Yeah, you know they did it frozen. This is how it's just strong. I'm not driving home. <laughs> Oh, what? Yes. This is literally so good. Try this. It's a frozen Long Island. Did you know they did that? Can I get a frozen Long Island? Yep. That's so good. Oh, so good. Hmm? I don't know. I was just gonna get one. We're probably not gonna be able to stay. Here. I'm gonna see where Darion is. I'm drunk. Wow, that's nice. Oh, good morning. I'm alive. Listen, y'all. That that frozen Long Island tea had me. It's like a frozen Texas tea, is what it's called. It had me. All right, baby. Okay. <laughs> Last night, I only had to have one of them joints, and then I kind of like sobered up really quickly. Y'all see this mess? We're about to address it. But the new show of the week is Scandal. I'm hooked on Scandal now. Paige got me hooked on Scandal. I'm rewatching it from the beginning. I've seen it before, but it's one of those shows I've never rewatched, so I don't really remember everything. Um, so I'm rewatching it. I loved it the first time I watched it. Judah's over there. Yeah. Need to put him on some clothes. Um, and then just clean up. <sighs> Every day is just cleaning up. <laughs> I just need to clean up. It's 10 o'clock. The boys are going to get their hair cut at 11. So Aaron will probably be here like in like half an hour. And then, oh, I'm getting a phone call. Uno momento. And then, um, I gotta go by the house to get the power cut on at the other place. So that's the plan, and then we're going to the birthday party. What's up? You look dead. Are you hungover? Why am I just not waking up? I have a little headache. I think that tea gave me a little headache. What's up, my love? It's your favorite hot mess mom. Ugh, the white man on this show is just so handsome. Anyways, let's pause. Okay, so I got the kitchen cleaned up. I talked to y'all briefly this morning because I was talking to my friend and then after I talked to my friend, I talked to my sister. I called my sister because I'm going with, over to my, um, to, to, to the birthday party. So I was just trying to see where she was at, if she was going catch up with her a little bit so now I am I was gonna do my hair but I honestly don't feel like it like y'all <laughs> I don't feel like it I, I don't so I'm just chilling at the house now I'm gonna order some lunch originally I was gonna go um let's just turn it down Olivia's so weak she's so weak she just be giving it up she just be giving it up it's okay. It'd be like that. <laughs> but anyways, okay. Okay. So, all of this stuff behind me. I think next week is when I'm really going to start organizing and packing, like, more moving content. But all this stuff behind me right here is just, like, I was sorting through what I'm going to keep, what I'm not going to keep. Like, thing, just, like, taking everything out of the cupboards. I did get some boxes, so let's open those up. But, yeah, I'm supposed to go by the house because I called to set up the electricity um, over there and they were like because it's like it's new construction and nobody's ever lived there before they don't have like the meter number on file so I have to go get the meter number and like basically call them just before five so they can get the service turned on is it getting rose look at my look at my uh, my fupa I really need to work out you guys I love y'all y'all have been DMing me on Instagram like girl did you work out and I'm just like no I didn't work out because I literally just like I haven't had time like I've literally been like ripping and running and 
I guess I am kind of making excuses. I feel like a couple times this week I could have gone in the afternoon, but I literally just didn't even think about it because it's like, it's like the last thing on my mind, to be honest. Like, I want to go, but I feel like I also need an accountability partner that's like, makes me get up because the only time I used to be really consistent in the gym is like when I had a friend I was going with every morning at 5 a.m. like she would call me and be like bitch I'm here like let's go and so I would get up for her because it's easier for me to do stuff for other people than it is for me to do it for myself um so yeah I was just like but I know I just need to go I, I just need to get back on a schedule so I think whenever I like really get moved and settled I'll be able to like be on a better schedule and I'll try to go like early in the mornings while the kids are still asleep because I feel like that's the only time I can really get it in is if I go at like 5 a.m. and I just can't get up at 5 a.m. like I'd be getting up to pump and then I'd be like some mornings though I have been staying up but I've just been taking it slow like taking the time to you know give myself a good shower and like you know taking more care of myself in other ways um so I haven't gone to the gym. I feel like I set that goal and I didn't really think about it that much. Um, it's still something that I want to do because I want to be in the gym and be back active and get back into shape. But I'm just, it's just, it's just, it's not looking like, it's not looking like it right now. But anyway, these boxes, I got some no tape boxes. So you're supposed to just be able to like pop them up and then put the lid on there. This is interesting. Is there instructions for us? Okay. Well, those are the handles. about moving like the stuff that I know I'm for sure keeping this like because I'll show you on the bathroom I have some stuff that's like socked up whatever I'll figure out the lid part later this is all we needed I think Melo is waking up so let me show y'all what I'm talking about really fast before he gets up so we have don't look at this but this like basically stuff like this like that i have like multiples of i was just gonna go ahead and like take over to the house like i have like all their kind of like bathroom stuff stocked up in here and shit like this i can just take and then i have like some stuff over here too but this is not as organized obviously what you talking about you ready eat eat you fussing? Are you fussing? Hi. Okay, let me get your bottle. Hello, Mr. Mister. My hand's cold. Oh. 
When I put ice on, I am so Welcome to the channel. Can I get for you today? Hi, I was just wondering if you guys can sub regular milk for oat milk. I'm sorry, could you repeat that? Can you, is there any way, and like, if I get a smoothie, you guys could sub the like whole milk for oat milk? Yeah. Okay, can I do a banana boat, a regular, you want that? regular, and can I replace the for milk? 20 ounce? Yes, and can I do oat milk instead? Yeah, so instead of the non fat milk, you would do oat milk? Yes, please. Anything else for you? And then can I have a large water with extra ice? A large water? Yes. Yep. Would that be all? That's all. Alright, you can close the little bit. Thank you. Alright. It's a little bit later. We ate our Chick fil A and lunch and stuff at home. The boys got dry swimsuits on. Cars packed up. Um, I wanted like a drink or something, but I didn't want to no, go. Swim chunks. Swim chunks, excuse me. Anyway, I was gonna go to Starbucks and get a pink drink because it's coconut milk. It's supposed to be like good for your milk supply, whatever, but I, um, I, I just didn't want to drink that today. So I was like, Smoothie King's right next door. So I subbed my regular milk for oat milk which is also supposed to be really good for your milk supply so I'm about to drink that I always get a banana boat that's my favorite and then I got a large water so what does that mean of course yeah, after your brother's done but you need to be careful and hold it tight because it's heavy Okay, I'm about to put my pumps on while we're in the parking lot. I don't even told y'all I got the mom cozy in a vlog. I think I only posted it on my Instagram. I had packed this thing back up and everything and I was ready to ship it back off. But I had to pull it back out because my Spectra died and I needed to pump. Um, but anyways, yeah, I don't not like the mom cozy. I feel like it gives good suction and it like empties me out. But like it tore my nipple up because this part right here is silicone and while I get that they probably thought it was more comfortable or because that's what it's marketed as like comfortable because it's silicone like if you don't put like nipple cream or coconut oil it like rubs against the skin like the plastic is almost like better that I have with my spectra cups than this material because it's like rubber and could you imagine your like dry nipple like that probably sounds explicit but that's what it was doing so anyways I decided to change into my skims just in case because we're at a water park like if I get wet or whatever but I'm about to put my pumps on really quick and pump while I drive I'm dang near gonna take my whole shirt off I'm not gonna, I think that's what I'm gonna do hopefully people don't be staring at me in the parking lot but this if this like skims top like for the water is it's tight okay I'm not trying to drive all constricted it's already hotter than itchy double hockey sticks outside so all right we got one cup in the only other thing i don't like with mom cozy either mom cozy either is like the way it twists into the cup i feel like it takes me a minute to like get it on there and like get it right and then also like granted it is sealed but this morning y'all i lost like four ounces pumping with these because um it wasn't like the tight all the way and it like was spilling out all over me and I didn't even notice because I had like my blanket under my boobs and it was just spilling all over and I lost like all my milk this morning out of this boob and I was really sad so yeah but I mean they're not horrible pumps I think I don't know I just feel like there's not like a perfect pump out there like we're supposed to be there at two o'clock so we're gonna head there hopefully I'll get some I should have brought my GoPro because it's waterproof. Mm, should I go home and get it? I'm close to the house. And we're gonna be early. I mean, black folks gonna be late, so. Maybe I'll go back and get my GoPro. I don't even know if it's charged though. It's probably not charged. Dang, I should. I always forget that I have my GoPro. 
Oh, that I, have, well, I got one. I got one when we went on our trip to Colorado in December. I actually have like live ass footage from our when we went skiing. What do you have? Do you have goggles for us? Oh, I do not have goggles for you. Am I unprepared? I didn't know you needed goggles. You need goggles? Yeah. Well, hopefully they have some we can purchase at the rec center. It's at like an aquatic rec center in Frisco or something. Well, I can switch. Okay, well, I'll see about getting you some goggles, okay? I didn't even think, I didn't even think about Tomorrow? it. Tomorrow? No, I'm gonna try to get you some today. But, all right, I gotta focus on driving, so I'll see you guys. y'all that water park tour uh, daddy? your daddy's coming he's bringing a baby out the house but we're about to head to Panastack to go bowling so I'm gonna just see y'all when I get there because I got a pump on the way and everything I was just coming to check in because I was dead after we left the water park and I didn't even get a lot of food from the water park because that was the first time I had been out like with all three boys besides like to that quick target daddy room that I went to the, the other week like your daddy is driving your dad is driving I'm sitting here to reverse no, I'm not driving. Mother is driving this car. <sighs> I'm not driving. I am not fucking driving. This thing is true. <laughs> I, I drove yesterday to let him get some, some some sleep. I am not driving again today. We both was just laying down. So he finna um he finna drive. I'm just backing up so he could park the other car in the garage. <sighs> Y'all, it's a day. We still didn't go by that house and see if the electricity was cut on or nothing. I don't know if it's mosquitoes out or something, bro, but y'all, I'm literally, like, bit up and itchy and, like, that is so... Ooh, that's like... Ooh, I hate that. I know he not walking at me. Oh, well, what is going on?
check the front door really fast to get these Amazon packages. But there's a spider. I don't know if it's dead or what. He's still be alive right now if he needs to gas him up. I'd be so scared when I bring packages in because there's so many spiders over here. I'd be trying to like kick the package around a little bit. Make sure there's no bugs on it before I take it upstairs. Ah. But anyways, good morning. My camera was down here anyways. I had to come down here, but <sighs> it's Sunday morning, so Today, we've got low-key a lot of stuff to do. I gotta go get my nails done this morning because I was supposed to get them done earlier in the week and then I told you guys what happened. They literally are like chipped everywhere. They look a mess. And if I'm gonna be filming next week, then I just need to like have them done. So, I just got out the shower. I think I'm officially over the light hair and I'm gonna go back dark. <laughs> I think I'm not gonna go like black, but like a dark brown. But yeah, I don't think that I am fucking with the light hair anymore, y'all. But I had to do it so I could know if I was gonna, if I ever, cause I've never dyed my hair lighter before. So I had to do it just to see. Just to see if I liked it, you know? So anyways, all the boys are upstairs. If y'all can hear the TV, it's up super, super loud very chaotic um we're about to there's a flat in the woods i'm about to i guess pick up a little bit because y'all know the house already back a mess if i cleaned the yesterday listen to how loud the tv is maybe i go like there let me see the remote the TV is too loud. Um. Anyways, okay, well, I have like 45 minutes until I leave, so I don't know what I'm up to. I guess I'm gonna just build some boxes and I don't know. I don't know because I want to film over there, but I don't know if I'm just doing it on Monday. Anyways, I got these bags for moving from Amazon instead of boxes because if we're going to be moving slowly, I feel like I could just fill these up and then like bring them back to the house, if that makes sense, and just like keep doing that instead of like breaking down boxes, buying more boxes. I'm sure I'll buy some boxes, but for especially for like clothes and stuff like that, I think this will be easier so i think i got like a six pack of like large large or extra large of these black bags when we move to this new house I think I'm gonna buy okay I've been debating I don't know. I've been debating on whether or not I was gonna get a love sack couch or the Thomasville sectional couch from from Costco I'm sure there is 
Sorry, leave him alone, please. Go put that in the trash. Go put that away. Um, but anyways, the Thomasville sectional couch is like eight pieces. It's similar to the love sack, but it's, it's way cheaper. Um, and it's kind of more of like the cloud type couch material, not the, the as firm as a love sack, but I'm thinking I'll just get a love sack. Yeah. yeah. Um, Carter, don't pull on the blinds. Um, no, there's wasps out there. No, there's wasps out there. I'll take y'all with me over to the other house in a minute whenever we whenever I come back. Nah, we're not going to play with the wasp. We have like wasp nests up on our patio. And Aaron's dad had knocked them down while he was here, but they just keep coming back. They're in our, on our front yard, too, because, like, at this house, we have, like, a little bit of a front yard, but it's just grass everywhere. Yeah. Um, these are your brothers. Would you like some more? Because you already had some this morning. Do you want some more? Carson slept in today until, like, 9 o'clock, but Carter been up since. You want to come eat some oranges? Yeah! Come sit down. I want more oranges. Yeah, I want more oranges. I want more oranges. Sure, I'll hold the baby's milk. Okay, well, you can share and I'll get y'all. I'll peel some more in a second. Are you done with your milk, bud? You say good morning. Y'all, this pimple though, oh my goodness. I'm losing my pregnancy glow. <laughs> uh, it's really the fucking birth control, like birth control even like it literally makes my skin <sighs> just mess up. Speaking of which, I need to take it right now. <sighs> but anyways, yeah, so I think I'm gonna order it today, the couch so that it can come in by next week. So I told you guys we're gonna like move slowly, but it's really not gonna be that slow because it's already July 3rd. So we really gotta like, I gotta start, you know, it's just, it's been something. It's always something. Just back to back to back. We had birthday weekends, now it's 4th of July. The kids are out of school tomorrow. So just like a whole lot of work to do. What is that? <clears throat> And a whole lot of work to do. And a whole lot of moving to do. But today when I go over there, I'm going to take pictures of everything to like kind of like get the space in my head. What, baby? Huh? What did you say? I, I, I feel like I know what you're trying to say, but you're trying not to say because you know you're going to be in trouble. So what did you start? He what said, you? he said, why are you going to take pictures? It sounded like he was trying to say, be quiet, be quiet. Anyways, okay. So, yeah. I'm going to go over and take pictures today because I'm trying to also decide if we're going to take this dining room table that's right there. Also, I don't even know if I'm going to keep those mirrors because it's not going to be the same color scheme. Everything is black here because we have black, black counters. <clears throat> and we did already have a black sofa when we moved here, but, but, um, yeah, everything going into the new house or like the new furniture I'm gonna buy is gonna be white because it goes more with the cabinets, the theme of the house. <clears throat> so for right now, I'm just gonna build the rest of those boxes that I did yesterday. These. Something quick today. Okay, baby, then I guess 
<laughs> I was, I don't know, because I, I think I really need a new set, but yeah, I can, can I fill for one more week and then I, I can come back? Color because this one is light, so, and this is drawing. Okay. So it come out. Okay. So no paper sheet today, no, not today. I'm gonna have to come back later. And just like that, we're done. Y'all, I just be having y'all any type of angles because we just really hanging out. Like, I can't, I can't. She got me in and out in like, it felt like 35, it was like 40 minutes. But this what I end up getting. Like, I literally. Hold on, my, um, I just got like a fill and then with the color I had, like my base color and then a clear top coat and call it a day because I was like, I just need some quick duty. I'll come back. I scheduled another appointment for Friday and I'll come back and get my toes done and stuff, but I need to make sure the electricity is on over there, so I just got to get in motion. But I couldn't keep walking around with my nails looking like that all week. I also Ubered Eats McDonald's. Because I really thought it was going to take like a little bit longer than this. I wanted to try their new lemonade frozen thing they have. And they didn't even give me lemonade. They gave me like... Mango. That's nasty. I don't like mangoes. Bruh. Whatever. It's cool. I'll just give it to one of the kids when I get home. And then I got myself a chicken sandwich. And then I had or I had Uber Eats the kids' food while I was here. Um. Cause they're at the house with Micah. I'm about to go back. I'm gonna pick Carter and Carson up. I'm gonna leave Melo at the house with her. Cause I had asked her if she could keep them until like two o'clock. Cause I didn't know how long it was gonna take my nails. But Carter keeps asking me to go see the house. So I'm gonna take him with me to see if the electricity's on. And I'm gonna call my brother and see where he is. Trying to mess with the air really fast. But the power's on. Boys are running. I want to take pictures of like all the closets and stuff before we leave so that I can know what type of organization system I'm gonna do. You have to go back home and get your brother, baby, and we don't have nothing here. Do they look glowy? <laughs> Melo's right here eating next to me. We both gotta eat. I'm starving. I'm starving. Aaron and the kids are asleep. I'm not sure you do cold. I'm gonna put them up with. It's the, it's the end of a Sunday night, y'all. So I guess it's the end of a vlog. I'm trying to think. I'm not even gonna cut. I don't even remember what the goals were that I set for this week. I think one was to work out. I can't even believe the whole week is gone. Like, I don't even feel like it's been a week since the last video I uploaded. Like, that's crazy. You good, Mello? I'm finna get you right. I'm finna get you right. But yeah, I don't even remember what my goals were. I'm not gonna cap. I think it was like, wake up earlier, get organized, and work out. 
None of the above happened. I woke up early, but that's because I got an infant that wakes me up. <laughs> When I started doing these, I really thought I was going to just like, I was going to get it done. So I feel kind of embarrassed that I haven't completed my goals for the week, but life's just been happening really fast lately, so. It's just about keep trying. Okay, we're just going to keep trying. So. Maybe I should just set one goal instead of like three goals. Maybe that'll be easier until I get my time management under control and like on a better schedule. Hmm. What should my goal be this week? My goal for next week is really going to be drink more water and get my milk supply up. That's my goal for next week. Okay. I also said in my last video... So I was going to just start doing giveaways. I haven't figured out exactly the kinks right now in my head of how I'm going to do the giveaway. But I do have something ready to like give away. So check the pinned comment. I'll leave a pinned comment on this video of how to enter. You only have 24 hours to do it since this vlog is like once this vlog goes live. So if you missed it already, make sure you make sure you um turn your post notifications on for next time. So that you'll know um when the giveaway is, but I'll post it, I'll leave the pinned comment for the instructions, and then it'll be posted on my Instagram when this vlog goes live. So good luck! You'll see what it is on IG. And I'll see you guys in another video.